let's go to check the automatic audiometry module of the audiometer Sibyl Sound Duo. This is an option for the audiometer, so if we need to activate it we must follow these steps. Configuration icon, maintenance, and the key icon. We will use the 20 digits located on the CD label and we confirm. The Houston Westlake test allows users to perform an air conduction tonal test in a fast, simple manner with minimum technician intervention. To perform an automatic test, you must select the mode on the main screen. To personalize various parameters for the automatic test, access the test configuration menu and press the test HW icon. A screen appears where the following automatic test items can be customized. The threshold method means the quantity of right answers required by the patient to get the threshold level of each frequency, 2 of 3, or 3 of 5. Continuous or pulsating tone. Starting level. Random off time and tone duration. And finally, the selection of 11 frequencies from 125 to 8000 Hz. The 1000 Hz frequency is always examined and does not appear on this screen. To start the automatic test we will select the mode from the main menu. This screen will show the type of tone, the start pause by the play icon and the test stop. On the right there is the familiarization icon and the channel selection, left or right. The intensity of divis, the frequency in hertz is the test results, the new patient icon, the disk to save the test and the configuration menu. To start the test, we need to create a new patient or select from the database. During the Houston Westlake test, the audiometer will record automatically the hearing thresholds by the patient response button. We will select the first ear to explore by the LR icon. Then, we will start the familiarization procedure by this icon to teach the patient how to perform the test. This starts with 1000 Hz tones at different intensities, which the patient needs to respond to by pressing the patient's response button. This process identifies a level of intensity close to the threshold, which is used to start the automatic HW test. If we need to talk with the patient during the test, especially when using a booth, we could enable the intercom option pressing the right controller. This will pause the test. After the familiarization process, Press the play icon to start the automatic test. The unit will issue different tones at different frequencies, following a process similar to the one in the air conduction tonal test. It will start by issuing a 1000 Hz tone with an intensity 10 dB above the one identified during the familiarization stage, or with the intensity set as starting level on the automatic test configuration screen. At any point, press to pause the test. The second icon will allow us to see the results. Click on the pause icon to resume. After determining the frequency threshold, the intensity and frequency values turn green for a second, and the threshold is stored. The audiometer will move automatically to the next frequency as per our HW configuration setup. The first tone level applied at each frequency will be the same as for the 1000 Hz frequency. After the high frequencies have been examined, the audiometer examines again the 1000 Hz frequency to check the consistency of the results. If the difference between the first and the second 1000 Hz exam is equal or more than 10 dB, the message inconsistent results appears, indicating the difference value, and the test stops. If the difference is below 10 dB, the test continues, examining the lower frequencies. Once all frequencies for the first ear have been examined, the audiometer automatically changes to the other ear and examines it for all the frequencies. For the second ear, the 1000 Hz examination is only performed once. After the process, the message test completed appears. Press this icon to save the test. 
This icon will be used to display the saved thresholds and diagnoses. If the data export option is available, and automatic export is on, the files will be automatically sent to your network. Civil Sound Duo, a new concept of screening audiometry.